Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be a what's in my bag. I did one of these videos before but um, I use different bags all the time but I'm using a different bag now to that one and I'm also using some different stuff inside my bag so I thought we would do an updated one. Um, so the bag I'm using at the minute is this one. It's the Michael Kors Jet Set Zip Top Tote I believe. I bought this at the Michael Kors outlet at Cheshire Oaks and it's the printed um, sort of coated canvas it's very very similar to the Louis Vuitton canvas if you ever heard of those bags it has leather cream handles which are adjustable but I've just left them as it came and it has a little Michael Kors tag which you can remove if you like I've kept it on it has two pockets on the outside these are really really useful especially if you buy sort of bottles of water while you're out or you use an umbrella because it it means you can put it in your bag um, with it being separate to everything else so I especially use this front pocket um, if I go out and buy water or Diet Coke or something and I don't finish it and I want to carry it around it fits a bottle in quite well so uh, it has a zip all the way across the top um, which means it's very very secure the shoulder straps are really really comfortable to use it fits nicely on the shoulder it fits over jackets and everything it's a really really handy bag to use it's good size it's not too heavy it's very very light without anything in so it doesn't weigh you down and i just really really like it so i'll start with the pockets that's the inside as it looks now it has pockets and one big section so on the first pocket on the front side pocket i keep my phone it's iphone 5s and on the back i have this red cut out phone case from Primark it has a little bird on it it's just standard iPhone really it looks like I've got loads of Instagram comments to reply to um, so in the second pocket I've got some hand sanitizer this one is the Marks and Spencer's one I really like this one actually it's the orange one soft coral I don't go anywhere without hand sanitizer I think it's a necessity I really really need it everywhere I go and moving on to the back pockets now I have in the first pocket a card holder this is also from Michael Kors it's the gold one and in here I keep loyalty cards and stuff that doesn't fit in my purse I've got Costa, Superdrug, um, my L card for my L subscription you get loads of discounts with this um, this one is for the mall in my local town I've got Ryman and I think that one is Sally's so I've got quite a lot of cards in there if I'm using a clutch bag or a small bag that my purse doesn't fit in, I will um, take these out of here and use my sort of um, debit card and ID and stuff in here instead. Um, but when I'm using it in a big bag, I use this for extra loyalty cards and things like that. The second pocket at the back is where I keep loads of like beauty stuff. Um, so I have all this stuff in the back. The first thing I have is some little tiny plasters. These are generally um, if shoes rub me or I cut myself while I'm out but I generally use them for shoes when they rub me <laughs> and hurt my feet I've got one of these um, Invisibobble things this is the dark brown one I got these from Topshop they are really really good um, because you can put your hair up in these and it means it won't leave any kinks uh, I mean it doesn't really matter if my hair is natural like it is today but if I've straightened my hair um, and I get really really hot when I'm out or I would just want to put it up out the way it means that I can do it and not have to worry about it being all weird looking when I take it down. So they are really, really good. They're quite expensive. I think they're about £5 for three. So they are expensive, but they are really, really good. I then have my eyeliner. This is the Super Cat Liner from Soap and Glory. I carry this around just in case I need to touch up or in case I smudge anything. Um, if I don't have wing liner on, I don't carry this around but generally I do if I'm wearing wing liner. And then I also have a lip liner. This is the one I'm wearing today. It's the Primark brown one in shade number 10. I've done a blog post about this and I've used it in a get ready with me and I've talked about it on my blog. So um, I really, really love that liner. I also have a mirror. This is from Primark. It has a little French bulldog on it. It was a pound and it's just one of those um, flip mirrors. One is a magnified side. I generally just use the normal side. Then I have this little purse, it has two little poodles on. I got this from a shop called Scribbler in Manchester. It sells lots of sort of gifts and cards and things. I went in to buy some cards and I just spotted it and I thought it was really, really cute. It's one of those plasticky ones that's white clean if it gets spilt on. And in here I keep the lipstick that I'm wearing, which is MAC Velvet Teddy. I've also got another lipstick that I wore yesterday, which is MAC Mineralize in Touch the Earth. It's kind of a nice, pale neutral brown colour. I also have in here 
a spare pair of contact lenses. I generally only carry these around when I'm wearing contact lenses because um, if I'm going out with my glasses there's no point. I also have a tissue folded up in here, normal hair bubble, a concealer. This is the Maybelline Superstay Better Skin Concealer in light. Quite good concealer. I generally carry this around to save me carrying around foundation and powder, especially if I've got a blemish or in case my foundation starts coming off during the day I can touch up with this and it'll generally um, do enough just to get through the rest of the day so I get home and I also have what a mini L'Occitane hand cream I don't use this very often uh, especially in the summer I use it quite a lot in the winter um, because I do get very very dry hands and this is a really, really tiny one so it's quite good to carry around in the zip pocket at the back there's actually nothing in there at the moment I also have in the main section now I've got a packet of tissues these are just from boots um, quite a general thing to carry around. I have this bag from Loxitan which has like tablets in and sort of feminine products and more plasters, bigger plasters and a Ren lip balm. This is a really really nice one. I got it with a magazine. It's the Vitamineral Lip Balm. Um, I keep it in my bag just so I can usually find it because it goes walkabouts in the house. Uh, but yeah I really really like this and what why I carry this one around is because it's in a tube so if you're in somewhere that you can't, don't want to be dipping your finger into a pot, this is really, really good. And also lip balm doubles up if your feet are rubbing. <laughs> you can use a little bit on there, um, wherever it's rubbing and it stops it hurting. You can tell it gets off feet a lot because of all the stuff I carry around to avoid it. I also have an umbrella. This is from Primark. This is an essential if you live in England. Sunglasses. I haven't emptied this bag since last week. It was sunny last week. It's not at the moment. These ones are just from Primark. I think I've probably shown them you before. Um, I generally wear them for driving or if I'm out I'll just shove them on um, but they are in my bag. Um, again if I'm not wearing contact lenses I wouldn't carry these around um, because there's no point um, but yeah I usually carry them. If I think it's going to be sunny if I'm wearing contact lenses I do um, put these in my bag because I tend to squint a lot and give myself headaches. Then last thing is my purse, this is a Karl Lagerfeld purse, I got it from Harvey Nichols, it's in the sale, um, summer sale, uh, it's just a black, like a textured leather, it has a gold zip all the way around and then it just opens into compartments like that, I'm not going to show you everything I've got in but um, I've just got like cards and ID cards, NUS card, Boots card, Waitrose card, Debenhams beauty card, Space NK card, my student ID from uni, um, and some Starbucks cards, some vouchers that have come out of magazines and stuff, the general um, stuff, and obviously a little bit of money in there as well. Um, but yeah, my purse is predominantly loyalty cards, but I am a big loyalty card lover. I think they're really, really good, and they do save a lot of money, so I do use quite a lot of them. But that is everything that's in my bag. I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel, and I'll link the bag down below, and any of the products that I mentioned that I can find online, I will link below for you as well. So yeah, I really hope you enjoyed it. Please subscribe if you're not already, and I'll see you in my next video.